Uh, hi everyone, uh, welcome back on my channel. Today I am sharing with you my top secret uh, recipe for the Nihari. First step for uh, this recipe, we will ground the spices. This is the key point for making this recipe. Once uh, you are done uh, grounding the spices, make sure there is no chunks or pieces are left inside the spices. That's very important. second part make the ginger garlic paste take half cup of oil and blend together with the garlic and ginger once you are done with that paste put it back into the pot and cook, start cooking on the low temperature until uh, ginger garlic paste become light brown I have uh, chosen mutton leg parts but if you get the shank parts they are really perfect for the Nihari. Keep continue saute until the meat color becomes changed. Once the meat color becomes changed then you can add all the spices inside the meat. Once you add water and soup together, then close the lid for at least 25 minutes. 
until your meat become fully tender. In the meantime, cut some vegetables, ginger like a Julian shape, lemon, couple of lemons like a wedge cuts and green chilies or red chilies, cilantro fine cut and uh, at least uh, one and a half onion medium size for uh, separately frying. Check your meat, uh, once your meat become fully tender, then you have to mix wheat flour with the water and make the paste and gently uh, pour into the pot. Uh, this is the another key point for this uh, recipe, that's how we make the Nihari soup thick. This is the last part of this recipe I am doing right now. I am making the tadka for Nihari. Uh, I am using same oil uh, where I fried my onions. I am adding 1 teaspoon of uh, paprika with deep fried onions, uh, approximately half a cup of onion, reheating and uh, putting back into the Nihari pot.
i hope uh, you guys enjoy my videos if yes please uh, subscribe my channel and uh, also share my recipes with your family friends that's helped me a lot bye for now until coming back with the next recipe